This is me, Didi, from Haunted Curiosities, and I'm back again with Nymphadora. <laughs> so, we were continuing on with um, Russia. Yes, and the mind control. Okay, so yeah. you had experienced yourself mm -hmm. a lot of things in yeah. your... Um, many, many years. <laughs> here, yeah, yeah. We'll, we'll, we'll just keep it like that. Many, many years. But, but some of the things you've seen are just beyond even your comprehension. Mm -hmm. But tell me about one of the things you you did witness that had to do yeah. with instantaneous like mind control of yeah. groups of people. It's like, crazy. Tell me. So I went to Russia and um, now how did you get there? Because uh, yeah. I know to go, you gotta have a sponsor. <laughs> you don't just go to Russia. Right. I mean, but I'm in Fedora. I know people everywhere. If I want to go to Russia, I'm gonna go to Russia. I okay. can get a sponsor like that. I can call up lots of people and okay. I can be there. So I went to Russia. Um, a friend of mine was living in Russia. Did you time. use Blotsky? Because I use Blotsky. <laughs> That's who I call. He's the one that got me in. I have used him before. Okay. Yeah, he's a sweet guy. Yeah. But, um, for this particular he's one. He's a hottie, I... actually. Do you know that he has three balls? Really? I don't know if it's from some kind of, like, one of their huh. nuclear accidents over there when oh, he man. was, you know, like, if, yeah, he's got three testicles. Oh, well. And he, and he wants sex, like, Eight, nine times a day, and which I'm sure you're aware of. Going through his body. Um, and, yeah. And I know you're aware of that, aren't you? I know you are. Of course. <laughs> he's, he's very hot. <laughs> yeah. I was going to say, I've used him before. Um, this time I needed somebody that I know could get me into certain areas because he wanted to show me how the mind control works. And we were actually out. Um, there was this field and there was these buildings, different buildings all over. And we were standing outside of a fence watching and there was all these people in the field and they're all walking, walking. And then all of a sudden the guy that was out there who was like in charge, he instantly yelled, stop. And instantly like that, everybody froze and stopped. But they couldn't hear him, right? Because they were, they, they, they were too far off. Right. Is that right. Yeah. Right. I want the people to understand because they're like, okay, so he yelled and they stopped. So what? No, he was over by the building. They so could not, out. absolutely no. could not hear no. him. No. It they was were like, out in the field. Okay. Yeah. He was outside. We could see him far off, but he wasn't close enough to the people that they could hear him, even okay. if he yelled. Um, it's a really big area. Sorry, I should have probably mentioned that. But they were out in the field, and he yelled stop, and they all instantly stopped on a dime. And it wasn't one person stopped here, one person stopped here. They all stopped together. Bam, stopped. And then he said, come. They all instantly turned at the exact same time and started walking towards where he was standing. And it took them a while to get there because they were pretty far out in the field at that time. But they so basically stopped. It was insane. His communication was intention. Yes. It was telepathic intention. Yes, exactly. This is what I'm telling you to do. You will do it now. And that is what all these kids that they picked through school, yeah. Yeah. that they picked through in various different ways, mm -hmm. is called telepathic intention. Yes. Yes. And this is how they get them to do what they yep. want. Yeah. And no way could these people have heard no, him. No, no. There's no way. No way. We were, we were standing. The buildings were here. The field was here. And it was way out. We were kind of closer to him. That's how we were able to hear it. But we didn't even see half of the people that were in the field because it was so far out. Once they started coming towards him, we seen how many people were really out there. But the ones that we could see, there was quite a few that we could see. And like I said... Everything was exactly at the exact same time. I mean, I've seen performances of children and things like that trying to get everyone to move at the same time. Marching bands, trying to get them to move at the exact same time in the exact same way. It's hard to do. But for him to get every single one of them to do it exactly at because the same time. Because in their mind, they're seeing or feeling all of his telepathic mm -hmm. intention, correct? Yep, exactly. Now, I know you told me I could ask you again and you would make a decision. <laughs> I'm hoping you make a decision right now. Okay. Can I tell them the other thing that he showed you? Yeah, yeah, go ahead. Or go no, ahead. are you, because I know, I know it's, are you sure? Because go I don't want you to be upset with me no, 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 and no. not do any more shows. No, no. And I probably shouldn't have asked no. you now, but I really no. want to. No, no, go ahead, go okay. ahead. Okay. Yeah, I mean, we're on the subject. Okay. Yeah. yeah, because I really want the people to understand exactly. just how strong telepathic intention There's, is. So I won't tell them about know. the one. I won't tell them about the one thing. Okay. I'll tell them about the disgusting thing. Okay, that's good. But not okay, the that vile. Works. That works. Okay, well, this is kind of vile, but not... You know what one I'm talking about. Yeah. All right. So, 
after these people gathered up to them, he had a dog. Mm -hmm. And, you know, dogs go to the bathroom outside. And the dog had left his potty business, <laughs> if that's what you want to call it, in a large pile because it was a large dog <laughs> over by, um, where was it you said? Where, where did he, he go by the... It was the, by the one building. It's kind of like um, like their mess hall, kind of, where they all go and eat. So behind there then? Yeah. Okay. Um, and he told these people to go and eat that dog crap. Yeah. And how quickly did they run over there to eat it? It was like a buffet. I mean, they were... And they're they all, were, like, pushing it, each other out oh of the yeah, way to eat dog like, shit. It wasn't like, oh, man, he's making us do this. They were... Okay, it was, like, normal. Go. It was yeah. normal. Yeah. And you thought that was just... Heartbreak. It was heartbreaking. It was disturbing. It was... It was disgusting. I mean, it was just seeing their faces as they were doing it. They, they didn't even care. No, no, they had no clue. What and they when did. they were done, they had no idea they did it, did they? No, none. Now, you being of Lilith's bloodline, mm -hmm. you are of dual nature. Yes. But you don't believe in right. depravity, mm -hmm. do you? No. no or I people don't... acting depraved or yeah. insane. Yeah. Now... Would you be uncomfortable? And if you are, just say so, because I really don't want to push you into it, because we do have a lot to talk about anyway. Um, would you be uncomfortable discussing the one thing that they did, the the one that was pretty vile? No, go ahead. I think I think that they should know this stuff. I mean, I... See, I do too. I like, I know so it's a very much. sensitive a subject. Of, right. A lot of it is really disturbing and hurtful and just sad. Really sad. But the more that comes to light, the more these people can see what's going on. And maybe they can see it themselves and be like, oh my goodness, I yeah. remember when... Well, the, the reason I, I want to discuss it is not because I want subject matter right. for the video. But because I have to wonder myself... How many people are we unaware of that can do such depraved right, things? Right. And then we don't know where it came from. Like, like, for example, if your next door neighbor, if you knew them all your life and they killed their whole family, right. you're wondering where did that come from? Exactly. Like, I didn't see that coming. Mm -hmm. And I think this could maybe answer some of those questions. So, so let me, okay. Um, he took three of those guys mm -hmm. and he waited until, I guess, what was it? They, they were all, the other people were on duty in one of the buildings. Yeah. He yeah. waited they for them to leave. Kind of yeah. Like and, and he took what, like three of the women? There was three of them. Yeah. So he took, he took three of the women. And if I explain it wrong, just, you know, jump in there. So he took three of the women and three of the men and he told them. I don't even think people are going to believe this. He, he told them to rape them and then cut them in half. Mm -hmm. It was, it was, it was terrible. I didn't know what he was thinking at the moment. I didn't know what the, the purpose of it was. But you didn't know at the time that's what he was telling them. Right. No. Because you always block yourself off. Anything like that. Evil. All that kind of stuff. I try to. I mean, you're able to know it. You're able I, to I see it. I try to block it out. Though. But he had direct. A telepathic intentional communication with those three yes. men. Yes. And now you did not see them cut the women I in half. I didn't see it. No, thank the Lord for that. But I he brought you back later and you saw it. Mm -hmm. And you also saw the men and they had no clue. No. That's that's probably like the, one of the worst parts because they did have any idea what they did, why they did it, nothing. They just, this is what you're doing and you're going to do it now. Bam. And he, and he told them, like, he told you that he even told them to have them shower and everything so that they wouldn't have any blood on them. They wouldn't have anything on them. No clue. And, and then that was it. They went back to their everyday life, and they like will never know. Ever happened. Exactly. And, they, and they'll never know, will they? No, no. Is there a way for them to know? There is, yeah. Yeah, there is. You can guide them back and things could, like that. Yes, yes. But it's not something you would want to do, do you? I don't physically want to see that because when I do things like that, but I But it can damage them, too. Exactly. Exactly. 
I mean, it's they just, don't know what happened. And I think sometimes... And they're going to watch themselves do it. Exactly. And I think that for this particular situation, I think it's for the best for them just not to know about it. Because that's only one particular incident that I know about. There yeah. could be more. And there could be stuff that's even worse than that. I couldn't imagine what it would be. I mean, we're talking dog be... crap, rape, and murder. Exactly. I mean, that's just... I mean... That's just the one thing that happened. These people have been under mind control for years. So heaven only knows what else has happened. Okay, I'm going to end this video and we're going to go to the next one. Here we go.